Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to Wednesday, the 27th of December. 42 degrees out here. I think it's supposed to be on and off rain for the day. It rained off and on last night. It's nothing, nothing heavy, just drizzles here and there. But, uh, yeah, we're in full-fledged wintertime now, or officially. But, uh, haven't gotten any winter. Well, they said it's supposed to be warmer and wetter, so... But uh, no winter stuff like we've had in the past by this time. But January and February are the two big winter months for, for us here. But uh, anyway, we'll bail out, go to work. Y'all come on along. See all them pine trees out there. It's cool is once you get towards the highway, it turns into fir trees. So got a good mixture. But look at them pine trees though. Man, they are just blowing up out there oh gotta go sorry for the quick departure i normally don't get phone calls at the time of the morning but that was an important one <laughs> i love it when it clears like that it's ooh, what trucker is freaking out on the horn somebody <laughs> somebody's not having a good morning but what I was going to say is how clear it is out here. I mean, if you could zoom your eyes in, you could see an elk walking on the power line mountains over there. I love it when it does that. Spring is always that way. You get that, those nice days and man, you can see a hundred miles away. And man, it's really comfortable. Might be the nice <laughs> cozy coat I got on or something, but yeah, very cozy and comfortable out here. And he's been driving for miles like this. Something ain't going right with you there, boy. Wake up and look out your mirrors. 46, mostly cloudy. And the last part of the ride here, it did start raining. It did sprinkle on Beautiful. That until we got down here towards Vancouver. You see it's the other way around. I but know it. Sometimes things go flip and flop. Mm hmm well, Mama? Yes, I have. We've uh, made it to hump day. We did. Oh, dang. Got another long weekend coming up, too. I know. Nice, nice. Please be a nice day in there somewhere. I know, but I'm dying to go for a ride. Yeah. Dang. Need to get your heated grips all wired in the, to the grommy grom grom. Yeah, I just worry about how fat those things are going to be. Yeah, we'll see. Yep, if you don't like them, you just take them right off. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Mama. All right, Hubba. You have yourself a wonderful day. You too. I'll see you as it passes by. All right. All right, love you, see you, bye. I love you. Bye-bye now. Bye. So how was that for a quick day at work? <laughs> It was a, another one of those nothing to film days. So in lieu of that, two things we need to accomplish today. Well, one I want to do, and then the other one, we promised you guys we are going to do it last night. We'll do a mail call after I'm done messing around in here. But we've done the relays on the uh, Classic 350, the GT650. Let's, um, let's see what they're like on the, on the Himalayans. They're under the, I know I've seen them under the seat, but uh, let's, uh, let's go check this out. The she hemi. Let's flop that. Oops, sorry. Flop that over there. Ooh, I thought they were right on top for some reason. Yep, I see one. It's got a light situation going on here. Oh, there's only two. I could swear there's three in there. Yeah, it even has a boot. It's only two. Hmm. Very interesting. Well, let's pop let's pop those two out and take a look and see what we got here. Holy moly, and things were tight in there. I mean really tight. And yeah, they're uh, they're very well gre <laughs> very well greased. 
like the other ones, but it, it's all, the grease and everything's all, it's starting to, looks like it's starting to coagulate a little bit, a little bit there. But man, those things were tight. I literally had to slip a tool in beside them and, and it works as a ramp. You get those things to start moving. They were in there. So, oh, getting grease everywhere. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. But, um, yeah, tight, really tight. So uh, let me grab my little, my little things here. I wonder what that is. 150. Um, AJT, does that mean adjust? WOC 4 8 dash. Somebody made some kind of a, some kind of a thing. I love it when they leave notes behind. And I don't wipe that thing, that stuff off. I love it. it looks like they were checking stuff. You know, even burned in a little okay there and stuff like that. So probably something that arose that they had to pay attention to and became part of the assembly. Check certain things out. Anyway, let's get my little tools out here and uh, make myself a little kind of a work shelf on the bike here and clean these things up. And look a little better. Got all the heavy stuff out of there. Got it all cleaned up. You know, it works really good for, because I just wet the terminals. And I mean, just, just make them damp. Use, you know, a zip tie that you've cut off. And use that as a little blade and use very lightly. Put the camera there. Just lightly wipe in between those blades. And just a little dab down in the holes there. You don't want it gooped on, but you do not want to put them together dry. Not in something that's exposed to the elements like these things are. You know, washing and riding in the rain. It, if you, as you guys see with spiders, them things are enclosed. They appear to be completely enclosed. But as you see, the mud and the gunk gets underneath there. You don't want them things to be dry. So don't overpack them or you could create the problem that's already going on. But just a light amount is all it takes. And I just kind of lightly set the, the relays in there a couple of times. If there's any buildup, then I'll wipe off the top a little bit. And uh, just make sure it's not just oozing like you've seen them when I pulled them out. But they do need to be damp. Use some good dielectric grease. I've got some... Yamaha stuff that's kind of getting questionable now because they discontinued that quite some time ago. And, um, but anyway, Permatex, I've always had great luck. We use it at work. Permatex and the, uh, what's the other thing do we have? Uh, uh, absolutely escapes me. Worth. From Worth. And, um, that works really good. We got that at work. But, uh, this works really well as, to, as well, too. And uh, just a hint, you can buy it from Amazon. If you want to get that part number, 22058. Um, you can buy it from Amazon less than our dealer cost at work. So just a little hint there for you. All right, let's get this thing greased up and put back together. All right, here's the camera in macro mode. Here's one ungreased, and there's one greased. So I just take the tip of that thing, just run along and just, just wet those things down. And then I just put just a little, little dub right down the hole of each one of those. And um, that's all it takes. And uh, they'll do good. So I figured, why here? Go ahead and put the, the iridium plug inside there. Just get it in. I don't notice as I'm taking it out, I've already put iridium plugs in it. And look at that. I got to clean that thing burns. Absolutely perfect. Take it coming. I got to put the plug back in. Same plug. <laughs> Slipped the boot up on mine and it has the iridium plug in there too. So uh, I got two spare. Oh, I got a spare for uh, the 350 coming Tuesday. And uh, so... I guess I have a spare for the Himalayans as well. But uh, anyway, it's all back together. I am i don't have enough time because Kelly and I are going to do a mail call thing tonight. I got an idea how I'm going to set things up in here. 
um, so we can do this a little easier so we're not fumbling stuff around. But uh, on that, I'm going to roll out on you. Got to come over here and take one more look at old Christmas here. I was talking to Tim today, talking about this time of year, you buy a motorcycle. I always tend to buy them towards the end of the year, it seems like, and then I <clears throat> dream of riding them for the for the whole winter, it seems like. But we'll get days. They'll, they'll come about. We'll get out. But uh, on that, I'm going to bounce. So uh, Kelly's Himalayans, that was perfectly fine. It may have caused a problem at some point, but it won't now. And uh, I'll do the same to mine, and we'll go from there. All right. So hang tight. We're going to do a mail call and a goodbye kind of combined. Well, hello there, YouTube. So, came out here to the shop because it's going to be too hard with wind and dogs coming and going and everything else on the porch. So we decided to come out here to do a little mail call thing here. Yeah. So, to start off with, um, I know it's after Christmas, but these are Christmas related. Just hang on. Both People don't even turn their lights off until New Year's, so I know. it's still Christmas, it's or Christmas the holiday season. season but yeah, there we go. Anyway, the first thing we got is a card from Terry that we didn't show you guys. That we told you how cool it yeah, was. Yeah, when he did that, why did I never remember what that painting stuff with the little diamonds is called? Oh, it, because it's called diamond painting. Okay, diamond painting. That's why you can't remember and the, it because you said it. The thumb wheels, yeah. <laughs> anyway, we forgot to show the card. Yes. A really Look cool how card. Cool that is. Isn't that, that beautiful? Ain't that birdie. That's very, very so, pretty. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks, Terry. Very much. I'll set those over here so All we right. get the mess out of the way. All right. And then from uh, Don, that uh, um, I guess it was, I'm trying to think how his name shows. I'll just call him Don. Yeah. <laughs> I don't it's know. Like I, I don't remember either. if that's how you show up on comments, whatever. We sent us a wonderful Christmas card. Yes. And of course, it's a train. You gotta do the trains. Yeah, I like the trains. Absolutely. And, he's, and then a really, really yeah, cool he, sticker. He has three free wheelers. Yes. I think it's him and his wife and maybe his daughter. I'm, I'm kind of thinking because I got a lot of spider people that have like three That's F3s. Really cool. and, and um anyway, he has, I love his sticker. Yeah. But they have That's three free wheelers. That's way cool. Three on three. Yeah. <laughs> That's three very three. cool. Thank you very much. Thank you, Don. Don is And very... your wife. Yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I don't know if she wants her to throw her name out there. Yeah, I wasn't going to, so she's just wife. Yeah. Without permission to and then, her name. <laughs> and then Gus, uh, Gus Two yes. Wheeling, you see, he comments every day. Him and Chris always comment. And I, I think I've done it to Chris a few times, so I've definitely done it to Gus. Call each other. I get their names, and Gus always goes, Who's he goes, Chris? Who's Chris? <laughs> Sorry about that. That's my dyslexic cousin. I get to go in on the comments there and lose my mind. So um, this is first the, the card he sent. Beautiful it's card. Cool. Isn't that beautiful, yeah. guys? And look, it's cool. It's, it's floating on there. Yes. Isn't it's that going awesome? To be an ornament. And of course, I'm not gonna. Yeah, you know, the the little foo foos and uh, uh -huh. the, the little secret uh -huh. stuff. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Yeah. That was really. That's sweet. really cool. Well, he didn't stop with a Christmas card. No, he was in the giving spirit. Oh, man, I'm here to tell you. Uh, yes. So, <laughs> so got some poker chips. I I haven't got a poker chip in a long time. I know. And I love it. They're from Winchester. Yeah. Harley Davidson. Yeah, we like the Winchester. Like Love the Winchester. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the for the poker chips. Oh, get everything in the same order here. In order and look at this cool magnet. Yeah, it's guys. like a little neon sign. But yeah. it's it's a magnet. Isn't that cool? Yeah. It's going to my magnet collection. Yeah, she's got her magnet collection. Mm -hmm. I love magnets. Every time I go somewhere, look me up some magnet things, I you know. know. <laughs> <laughs> I like magnets. Magnets and coffee cups. Yeah, that's really cool. That is way cool. And then, while that, he was at the Harley shop, he yes. got the little little mama little something something. Look, guys, this is beautiful. You got to hold her, oh, hold her high. Hold her high. Yes. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? It's on the back, Jack. Isn't that beautiful? Heck Can't yeah. wait to wear it. 
Thank you, Gus. Short Very sleeve much. weather will be here before you know it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Get her back. And then, Hold it up. only because it's two brands, he sent two shirts to me. I love this one. Yeah. Because I, I like the old, I know everybody freaks out about the AMF days, but that's back when that number one came out around that period. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Skyline Harley Davidson. Beautiful. Winchester, Virginia. Oh, yeah. That's some cool look at mama, she got to fold everything back up. <laughs> and this, as of late, means a lot to me. Mm -hmm. This is oh, cool. He was pumped. <laughs> he was pumped. He goes, what the fuck? Let me get the tag out of the way so you can see. Look at that. Look at this. The classic. Since 1952. That is really And he nice. didn't mess around. This is like, you know, genuine... I mean, that's for real for Roger D, Royal Enfield attire. Yeah. The Harley stuff is genuine Harley. And, um, this couldn't have been cheap. No. Thank you so much. Yeah, that's that wicked. That had to cost you a fortune, guess. Yeah. Yeah. Oddly enough, they didn't have, they had a few shirts and yeah, they had hats, dress. but there were more of those built, I like, I kind of like a ball cap kind of mm -hmm. hat that almost, you know, it'll fit your head. And uh, instead of the big bulletin board thing, like they started in the, what was that, the late 70s, 80s, whatever. Yeah. But they just, I call it a bulletin board because there's always a big advertisement across there. But mm -hmm. I don't like them things. I mean, I, I think sitting six inches above my head. And I got a little head, so it, it looks weird. I, I can't, I can't do hats. I love hats, but I look funny in hats. You think that. I love it oh. when you wear your hats. Well, they have to be baseball style. Yeah. Look at me, I got hardly... Spider, I'm, tell, I'm working. She's got the work shirt on. I'm still haven't gone to PJs yet. Let me tell we doesn't doesn't matter if it's riding on two or three. We're happy. Mm -hmm. Yes. Heck yeah. But thank all you guys for uh, very much for the cool Christmas gifts and stuff. And that's very nice of you. I having a all the Terry the all the thumb wheels I got them sitting there with the controllers like I was telling you the other day it's pouring down rain out there I haven't even touched a or I haven't even played with the little micros in the house so I don't know but yeah it's been winter. busy getting ready for Christmas yeah. and yeah just not enough hours then when I the think day. about going out there playing it's just a mud pit I know it. need to put a barrier wall that's weird that it's never done that before I know I wonder I why just the land changes, yeah, the plants just, move. Maybe the planet killed her a little bit and yeah. it's pushing everything south or something. You need to build a pole barn. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, we definitely need that would be another fun. another shop. Mm hmm Have a motorcycle shop and just turn this thing into or whatever. We just build something. Yeah. Things down the road. I know. We can get to rattling. Yeah. But anyway, thank you guys for uh was a Kind of a motorcycle stuff and then a mail call. Yes. And a goodbye. <laughs> All in one. Yep. So we're going to roll on that. Alrighty. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. You guys have a wonderful Thursday or Friday. Heck yeah. All right. Bye. We will see you in the morning. We'll see you then. <laughs> Thanks for watching now. Bye-bye.